Hello everyone, this is Joy Universe. In this video, I would like to show you how to solo from the Enchant Formula Short-Footed from Kariza. Now a quick disclaimer, I didn't come up with a strategy myself. In fact, I learned it from a content creator, Zero G. Um, he, did it, uh, he did a video on his Hunter about 6 months ago. At that time, I believe only Hunter can do this farm, but now with the pre-patch, I believe every single class in the game can do this farm. Plus, the drop rate has been increased to 100%. And in this video, I'm gonna do it on my Shadow Priest. First, what you need to do is clear um, about 3 spider packs from the Servant Quarters. Uh, I think everybody should be able to do it easily. If you have trouble, if you have difficulty though, uh, I would suggest you use the platform uh, at the entrance. And these mobs can also be CCs, so feel free to use your fear, feel free to use your stun, and they are this should this should be pretty easy to kill. Now this is the second pack, and I believe there's a patrol which needs to be clear before we can proceed. Here we go. So this is the last spider we need to kill before we can proceed. Um, so what you need to do is go to this um, pillar or this wall right there, which uh, which has a uh, a chunk of it missing, and then you want to pop a elixir of giant growth. Uh, I think you can also use a winter spring fire water. It should work the same. Basically anything that can increase your character model size, you should do the trick. So um, once you use uh, the elixir of giant growth, you need to log out and then log back in. So once you are back in the game, you will notice that you can jump and you will land outside of the Karazhan building. We're still in the instance, but we're outside of the building. So now we, we want to mount up and go to where the river is and follow the stream, we're gonna go upward. So we're gonna follow this road. It's a pretty long ride, so feel free to skip it. But um, you might want to remember the path because it's a, it can be fairly complicated. I got lost myself a couple times, so um, yeah, feel free to pause and uh, play it back. Now I just want to talk about the Enchant Formula, uh, sure-footed. Uh, with the pre-patch, it has received some changes. So instead of giving you plus 5% of root and snare resistance it now gives you 10 rating of hit and 10 critical rating I think and since both physical DPS and caster DPS they all use the same hit and critical rating this formula now becomes I believe the best uh, caster DPS enchant for, for the boots so now we arrive uh, at the top of the mountain we want to jump up here um, from the right to land be, uh, between those two rocks and we're gonna, you're going to continue to jump until you arrive at the top. Now be careful, be careful uh, the way you walk because you can easily fall off the mountain. Once you arrive near this tree, you want to use Levitate, Slow Fall, Parachute Cloak or Nodrin Fogger Elixir depending on what class you are. And then you just walk off the mountain and uh, voila, we are at the Opera Hall. Only one mob in here can drop the formula, it's the Phantom Station. So we want to go up the stairs or the ramp and uh, look for that mob, which is right here. Okay, we only need to kill it once, so make sure you use every single god. You do not want to die here, because otherwise you will have to do the whole process all over again. So here I use my rocket boots. Um, I'm also gonna use my shadow fin to draw aggro for uh, uh, use my shadow shadow fin and fade to draw aggro for about 10 seconds. Give me some time to do DPS. And once my shadow fin dies, I'm going to use my dispersion to create some distance between me and the mob and drop off from the stair to create more distance while well, my dots are ticking and uh, from now I think um, it should be pretty easy 
So I think every class should be able to kill this mob um, No problem, just make sure you use all your cooldown And then you will have your formula Which is right here, like I said, the drop rate is 100% So you only need to do this farm once I hope you guys find this video useful And I will see you next time, bye